Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother... vlogs up for the last couple of days nothing exciting has been happening you know since the cold but now all of a sudden it is I'm sitting in the middle of Shelby Forest Lake in my kayak just having a blast out here decided to get the thing out see how well it works for 12 foot kayak sun dolphin it works great takes some getting used to the um, 10 footer I had before this was a little easier to maneuver but this one's a lot more stabler uh, I'm just out here floating around getting the feel of the boat I had to pay two dollars for a launch fee which you know isn't bad considering the fact matter I'm probably only gonna be out here maybe an hour but yeah decided to come out get some vitamin D hope I don't get sunburnt some fuzz or something on the lens nope Looks like it's a scratch on the inside. Weird. Oh well. But, yep. I'm sitting out here in the middle of the water. Wind's kind of pushing me around a little. But, God, am I having a blast. And say now... I'm going to have to get used to this boat because this is the one that I'm going to go down the Colorado River, down the Grand Canyon with. Hope to God it's not too rocky. But, man. But yeah, I've got a little storage compartment up there. I think it goes underneath here. And then i got one back there that's watertight where I was keeping the camera and, and keys, wallet, and such. I don't plan on overturning myself, but... You never know what happens with a kayak. <laughs> oh. I wish I had a GoPro. I really do. That way I could actually get footage of me paddling this thing and the fighting with it in the wind. Get someplace else around here. I'm probably going to shoot some more video. And here we go again around in circles. This is hilarious. Alright, I'll be back, guys. Hey, guys. I'm back again. A little closer to shore this time. But, yep, yeah, we came from way over there. I don't know if I'm going to go much further. Got to check and see what time it is. But, yeah, like I said, this boat's pretty stable. Make some of y'all seasick just from watching me rock back and forth. Earlier I wasn't doing it, it was the current that was doing it underneath me. God, this is so serene, so quiet. Watched a turtle jump off the shore earlier. I actually had a fish hit the bottom of the boat. That scared the daylights out of me. Now I got a bike to work out my legs and I've got a kayak to work out my arms. We just bobbing along. Like I said, I may well end up working my way back that direction. I don't know what the heck you were, but you're gone now. Some kind of bug land on me. 
one thing I am watching out for being out here in the middle of the lake is snakes. I know it may be 85 and it's, but I am not sticking my hands in the water. Hey, there's Mr. Turtle. I don't know if I can zoom in on him. He's over there. Found Mr. Turtle. But yeah, bird's eye view from the bow of the boat. Ooh. Hmm. No, no, I don't think I'll be going that direction. I need to be hitting my butt back in the direction of the dock. Gotta check what time it is. Is I'm just kind of bobbing along with the current of the water. Uh, <coughs> told y'all, I'd go anywhere where my feet, my wheels, my bike, or my kayak will go. See, these are the kind of places I would ex I would hope y'all would follow me. Alright, I've got to get the paddling because I'm getting too close to shore. Be back in a little bit, guys. Hey, well, we're back up here, close to the area where I launched and I went way 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 down there some people were some people were asking me about the kayak and uh, so I was just having a blast out here on it this thing's very agile very maneuverable Get, it skids across the top of the water just perfectly. Couldn't ask for a better one. <sighs> Welcome to the first day of spring of 2017. Just having too much fun in the kayak. Now I'm just drifting along with the wind again funny. Oh, check what time it is. 5.11. Figure I'll stay out here another 30 minutes or so and then head in. I hope you enjoyed coming out here with me and seeing what all's going on. So like I said, I'm going to have to get a GoPro mount on this thing so I can take y'all with me of where I'm going. I did have to kind of fight the current a little bit today because of the wa uh, wind. It's not too bad. But there will be many, many of more of these. Um, I'm Like I said, I am definitely going to look into getting a GoPro soon. Very soon. Alright, I'll be back. Well, we're out of the water. Had a blast. Definitely gonna have to do this again. Um, it's not the same as you know going kayaking like I did last year, going down a couple of rivers and such. But still, I mean, just to be able to get out in the middle of the river, um, away from people, is so amazing. I uh, had a couple of fish hit the bottom of the boat and scared the daylights out of me. Had a turtle damn near jump in the boat with me. I uh, saw some snakes. Stayed clear away from them. Um, wind could have been done without. I mean, we. it is a bit windy. I could have picked a better day. But, I mean, it's still 82 degrees. Really, you think I'm actually going to sit in a house and watch YouTube when it's 82 degrees when I have a kayak mount strapped down to the roof of my van? Uh, no. I... Definitely not. I... This was just too much fun. See about going to Shelby Farms and what it's going to take to launch there. I'm going to have to take a change of clothes. 
or just wear my throw my swim trunks in the dryer or just hang them to dry tonight and um, wear them under my clothes tomorrow that way I can just give it down to my swim trunks and change my shirt that sounds like a good idea after my doctor's appointment go to Shelby Farms and see about going kayaking there if the weather's just as nice. Uh, it's supposed to be 82 tomorrow. We were only supposed to get to 82 today. And they're saying 80 tomorrow, not 82. Ugh. I can honestly say, having this kayak on the roof of my van, you can definitely tell it's up there because it's 47 pounds. That's a lot. And yes, I hoisted the thing up there by myself. Uh, am I taking it down tonight? No, because I'm not going to sit there and have to drive all the way home just to be able to get the kayak and put it back on the roof of the van. People at work don't think I, can, I have a kayak or I can kayak. We'll just show them. I am so sorry if that sun is all in your face. Um, you know, I am driving through Shelby Forest now my way to the exit. Yeah, I was out here yesterday and did some bicycling and uh, took some pictures. And, um, man, I tell you, the hills are horrendous when it comes to a bike. You can go down them, but trying to pedal back up them. Oof. There was a couple of times I got 65 miles an hour on the bike uh, coming downhill and I tried to walk the bike up the next hill. They're that steep. And the trail I took has a zigzag, what I call the California twist, at the beginning of its trail, the Chickasaw Bluff, uh, out here in Shelby Forest. But it was, uh, that was a fun experience on the bike. I mean, I had to hit the brakes and almost use the front brakes a little bit to keep myself under control. Oh, so, we're on our way home. Like I said, I hope you guys had a good time. You know, even though uh, you couldn't see much except for me floating and bobbing around in the middle of the water. But, that's just to give you a taste of what is to come. Especially when I get a GoPro, y'all will definitely get to see more. Uh, you know, especially, you know, I, I get a GoPro. It's going to be um, bike, kayak, you know, things like that. Uh, I'm one of these. I'm, I'm even going to go hiking, and I will even take you all along with that. Urban explorations, those are definitely in the works. Um... I mean, I did the Levy Auto Parts. That was the first one I'd done in a while, and I haven't heard no repercussions. Kayak on the roof. I think I'll go left. But, uh, yep. Yeah, I'm going to end this vlog here, guys. I'm going to drive home safely on these curvy roads. Um, definitely, definitely hit that subscribe button. Uh, Hit the, not the bell notification down below so you can be notified when I um, put out a video. I'm trying to start doing the daily vlogs again. I just, there was nothing exciting going on. I mean, we were, had cold weather. I was sick. Um, and I don't think y'all wanted to see me all bleh. So, um... But yeah, like I said, hit subscribe, hit the, um, <clears throat> the bell notification, and if you feel compelled, a dollar a month, five dollars a month, you know, every little dollar helps. You can help fuel the adventure, so there's a Patreon link down below. Um, I'm going to be posting some Patreon exclusive videos there that aren't going to be offered on uh, 
YouTube. So, look forward to that. Alright? Y'all take care of each other and yourselves. Peace, and we out of here.